Hello, I'm James Norton for Chow.com Super Taster, and Denny's, the restaurant chain Denny's, is touring America with its menu right now, rolling out a number of dishes that are meant to represent different regions of the United States. Now, to give you a quick sum up of how sophisticated this uh, marketing scheme is, Brooklyn, which is one of the most diverse and food forward regions I think in the planet right now is represented by a 1200 calorie serving of spaghetti and meatballs and will Floridians connect with the sunshine salad you tell me Floridians uh, but I have my doubts so naturally I took an interest in the restaurants offering for the Midwestern part of the country which is the Midwestern meat and potato sandwich now a quick word on where I'm from and the word Midwest now the Midwest has been used to refer to a vast part of the country between the south and either the east and west coast but around here it's a lot more complicated than that I get a legitimately Midwestern cultural vibe from Minnesota Michigan Wisconsin Iowa upstate Illinois and a little part of Ohio. Uh, everything else you think of the Midwest is probably the Plain States or the cultural Mid-South. Back to the uh, back to the Midwestern meat and potatoes monstrosity that we're talking about. It is a 1,000 calorie, $7.50 combination of uh, prime rib, whatever that means, french fries, cheese, and gravy on a cheddar bun and mashed potatoes on the side, why not? Now that doesn't resemble anything that I'm familiar with eating in the Midwest or even the Midwestern part of Canada. What it is evocative of, I think, strangely enough, is a poutine from Quebec. Let's, uh, let's put this thing in our mouths collectively and see how it tastes. Oh man, oh, I imagine this is gonna be bad. I'm fired up by how much worse this is in my imagination. It is a salt lick. There must be, they must have just dumped an entire container of salt on this thing. It's slimy with cheese whiz. The meat is tough. Um, it, it's just like a, a culinary three mile island. If you're looking to experience a real taste of the Midwest, Upper Plain States, Mid-South or what have you, I would not put Denny's at the top of my list. For Chow.com Super Taster, I'm James Norton. If you don't already follow me on YouTube, please subscribe. I'll be back tomorrow with more food.